Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix disk write error with Forza Motorsport game on your Windows computer if you have the game on Steam. You might receive this error message. So if you're receiving this error message, then the first step is to allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. So if you have any third party antivirus, just make sure that you allow the game exe file to your antivirus program. Or you can now when you try to update the game, if you're receiving the error message, in that case, you can allow the game exe file to antivirus program. So uh, if you have a vast, not on, bit defender, McAfee, trend micro, Komodo, whichever antivirus program you have, make sure that you allow the game exe file to antivirus program. Now, if you are trying to install the game, like you don't have the exe file and you the game is not even installed, in that case, you can disable your antivirus program till the time you're downloading or installing the game. Once you are done downloading the game, once you are done updating the game, you can enable your antivirus program once again. Now, similarly, if you have the game, if you have the Windows security, then go to Windows, uh, Windows settings and then go to privacy and security, then click on Windows security. If you have Windows 11, click on privacy and security. If you have Windows 10, click on update and security, then click on Windows security. Now click on virus and threat protection. Now scroll down, click on manage ransomware protection. Now click on allow an app through contro control folder access. Click on yes to allow, then click on add an allowed app. Now click on browse all apps. Go to the game installation folder. So open program file 686, Steam, Steam apps. Open the common folder, open the game folder. Select the game exe file, now click on open. Now still you're receiving the error message. In that case, you can disable the antivirus like virus and threat protection. Click on manage settings over here and you can turn these off. Now, once you are done installing the game or once you are done updating the game, you can enable your Windows security once again. So once you're done, you can enable it once again. Now, still you are receiving this error message. In that case, the next step is to run Steam as an administrator. So first of all, close Steam, exit, and then type in Steam in Windows search box, and then make a right on Steam, and then click on run as administrator, and then try to update or install them. Next step is to uncheck read only on the Steam folder. Now for this, type in Steam in Windows search box, and then make a right on Steam, and then click on open file location and then make a right click on Steam, then select properties. Under the general, go to general over here and then if the option which says read only checked, you can uncheck this box, apply, click on OK. Go to this PC, you, uh, go to this PC, open program file 686. Now over here you can see the Steam folder, make a right click on Steam folder, select properties, under the general, uncheck the box. if the box which says read only, check, uncheck the box and then click on apply, click on OK, OK. And once this is done, you can, now you can open Steam. So this process may take some time. Now once this is done, now you can try to update your or install the game, open Steam and then do it. Next step is to clear download cache. Now for this, go to Steam. Go to Steam on the top left and then click on settings. Go to the downloads folder and then click on clear cache and then click on confirm. Your, system, your uh, Steam will restart and once that is done, now you can try to install or update the game. Next step is to verify the game file. If the game is already installed and while updating it, if you're if you receiving the error, make a right click on the game, select properties, go to the install files and then click on verify integrity of game files. After the verification, launch the game. Next step is to allow Steam full control in Windows. So again, open File Explorer and then go to this PC, C Drive, Program File 686. Here you can see the Steam. Make a right click on Steam, select Properties and then go to the Security tab and then make sure that you select your, your username, whichever username you have. Make sure that you select your username and once you select it, um, you will see Click on edit and then uh, over here you allow and then click on apply. Click on OK. 
So you have to select your username over here and then click on edit and then allow. Click on OK. OK. And then check. If that does not work, make a right click on Steam once again. Select properties. Go to the security tab and then click on advance over here. And over here, click on change. Here you can see the owner and change. And over here, type in everyone. And then click on check names and then click on OK. And then put a check on replace owner on sub containers and objects. And then click on apply. Click on OK. Click on OK. Apply. OK. And again, make a right click on Steam. Then select properties, security, advance. Now click on add over here this time. Add and then click on select a principal. Again, type in everyone. And then click on check names and then click on OK. Now put a check on full control. Now click on OK. Click on apply. And then now you can open Steam. Now open Steam. After you open Steam, go to game. Make a right click on the game, select properties, and then go to install files. Then click on verify integrity of game files. After the verification, try to install or update the game. That should fix the problem. Next step is to go into settings, storage, and selecting the download folder. Now for this, go to Steam and then go to settings and go to the download folder. Now over here, select the download folder, storage. Go to the storage over here. Let me check. Now, uh, storage, not the downloads. Go to the storage. Now, once you go to the storage, over here, select your drive. So, if you are trying to install the game on C drive, select C drive. If you are trying to install the game on D drive, select D drive. Whichever drive you are trying to install the game or update the game, you can select the drive over here. Select the right drive over here. And once you select it, now click on these three dots over here and then click on repair library. And once the repair is done, now you can try to update or install the game. Now, if nothing is working, last step is to uninstall and reinstall the game to different drives. So make a right click on the game, select manage, then click on uninstall. Now after the uninstall, go to the game installation folder, delete the game folder, and then restart your computer. And after the system restart, click on download, and then you can change the drive. So you can try to install the game to different drive and then check. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix disk write error with Forza Motorsport game on your Steam. So that will be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.